Alright, ladies and gentlemen, I'm here on the show, and I'm here to talk about on a game one of the NLDS with uh, Dodgers and uh, Padres here tonight. Oh my lord, I had so many nervous moments late in this game, man. Uh, but the Dodgers, they get out of this and they take game one and take a one nothing lead. Uh, game two will be at 8.03. Technically today, since it's uh, now, um, what, Sunday? Um, yeah, 7 5 Dodgers win. Oh my lord. Um, it didn't start off good. Um, San, Diego, San Diego scored those three runs in the uh, first inning. Um, I believe an RBI ground out, that two run homer from Machado off Yamamoto. I'm like, I'm, I start, I'm like, oh my lord, here we go again with the Dodgers postseason collapse. Because Yamamoto, um, I don't think he should have started game one. I felt they should have just kept with Jack Flaherty. But I guess it worked out in the end since our bullpen uh, was really good the rest of the way. So I guess it worked. I mean, it, it worked out. I mean, our bullpen was excellent. Besides Kopech, other than that, he just didn't have it tonight. But Blake trying to shut it down. He ain't going to pitch tomorrow, though. I mean, he threw like 40 pitches tonight. But still, he, done the, he, he got the job done. But Yamamoto, three innings, five hits, five earned runs. Um... Two walks, uh, one strikeout, and three innings. Luckily, the bullpen was able to back it up, and the Dodgers, unlike uh, the past few postseasons, they actually got clutch hits. Shohei Otani had a clutch hit. Um, T. Oscar had one as well. But great game from the Dodgers. I just wish the Dodgers stuck with the original pitcher they had for game one, but it is what it is. I mean, it's not the debut I wanted from. Uh, Yoshinobu in the postseason, but hopefully he'll be fine going forward. And he's allowed uh, he's allowed five plus earned runs and only two starts in this rookie season, and both starts have come against the Padres, believe it or not. But luckily the Dodgers were able to still win the game. He just didn't have the command. Splitters weren't hitting for strikes, and. It's three nothing early, but then Shohei gets that massive, massive three run home run with two outs off Dylan Cease. I, I, I jumped out of my chair when when that ball was hit because I knew that ball was gone. So both starters really struggled tonight. Uh, Dylan Cease, he struggled at the end of the season pitching against the Dodgers uh, to end the regular season. He really struggled here. And then after that, it was really a battle of the bullpens. But it's kind of just the little things that can uh, win or lose you games. It, it was really the bottom of the order that helped the Dodgers tonight. Uh, Will Smith walked twice. Edmund and Lux each had two hits. Rojas had a hit. They got on base four, five, like seven times uh, tonight. The six, seven, eight, nine hitters to, um, you know, get that to Otani. Will Smith had that walk. Uh, Lux had a hit. Edmund Rojas, I think he struck out. Or no, a strike out and a pop out. Then we get to Shohei Otani. But that's a big walk there to lead off the inning from Will Smith. It's 0-2. He gets the walk. Lux gets a hit. It's the bottom of the order that helped get uh, Shohei up. And then T. Oscar, who's been a hell of an addition for this team, had a clutch 2-RBI single. Uh, that gave the Dodgers a 6-5 lead. And also another little thing, the little things that can win losing games. That air, the start of the inning by Machado... Uh, the run ended, up, run ended up scoring that inning. Double play, but the run scored made it 7-5. to five. So that's a little thing, uh, another little thing that aired that cost uh, the Padres as well. They left the bases low in the 8th inning. They left 2 on in the 9th um, inning. So they had chances. It's not like they didn't have chances. Felt Blake Trine was probably, running out of, was probably running out of steam there at the end of his outing. But luckily got Manny Machado to chase some pitches and struck him out. Just a hell of a game. San Diego, the problem is with them, sometimes they, they score early, but then they kind of just, they don't, the offense just kind of stalls after that. Like, they can score early, but then they just kind of stall out. That's really what the Dodgers did. They done all their damage within the first five innings. Uh, but, yeah, we'll talk about this more, uh, but... After we tied the game 3-3, Yamamoto gives up that two-run, I think, double, single or double to, um, I think it was a two-run double to, um, 
Bogarts, I'm like, oh my lord, I thought we were going to freaking lose after that because we got all that momentum just to go back down. But then three runs in the fourth inning. On a wild pitch and then a two-run single. It was just an insane game. And this is a big game the Dodgers needed to win. Hopefully they can take these first two. So then when they go to San Diego, all they have to do is win one. So be good to win two. Uh, hopefully Jack Flaherty's a long outing because we kind of used a lot of our we used a lot of our bullpen tonight. Both teams did, so both teams' bullpens are gonna be tired heading into Game Two. Hopefully Dodgers can take Game Two. You know, get a go ahead 2-0 because then all you have to do is win one in San Diego. But Blake trying to shut the door, and the Dodgers they actually they entered today 0-14 in their postseason history after trailing by three plus plus runs in the first inning. But Shohei Otani didn't let that happen. Or T. Oscar Hernandez. They, they both didn't let that happen. Shohei and T. Oscar come up clutch in big moments. And the big moments, those are the guys you can trust. And the bullpen. I like our bullpen, man. We got a really deep bullpen. And, um, Dylan Cease, he got obliterated uh, tonight. Like, I don't know, like, he's, like, he's just inconsistent. I guess he, I guess I'm trying to say, I guess he's mid, I guess, maybe a hot take. I don't know. He just didn't, he just hasn't pitched well against the Dodgers. So, just glad we won tonight. The bullpen tonight in game one went six innings, only gave up two hits, didn't give up a single run, walked four, seven strikeouts. Incredible work. You can't ask for anything more than that. LA will need to rely on this bullpen to go far into the mat, to go far into this postseason. And shout out to Blake trying to five out, thirty nine pitch save. Credit to the bullpen. And to come two wins away from taking this series, I thought we were gonna freaking lose game one after that start. But Shohei wasn't letting that happen. The offense, I thought it was pretty good tonight. Ten total, ten total hits, seven runs. Freddie had two hits tonight. Mookie Betts walked three times. Two, two of them, he was intentionally walked. And then another question, but one questionable, questionable uh, decision I kind of had with Mike Schilt tonight was um, was that intentional walk to Mookie Betts? A uh, two-two count right there. The Dodgers ended up scoring, uh, getting a two RBI single that inning from T. Oscar. So that, I thought that was a questionable decision from Mike Schilt. Let T. Oscar up there. It's a two RBI single. Ball gets away from Merrill. That scored two. So that was a questionable decision, but that was the only questionable decision I thought from Mike Schilt. The bull, both bullpens pitch well. It's just the Dodgers pitched better. And Dylan Cease, he just didn't have it. So this is gonna be a hell. Of a, this is gonna be a hell of a series. Like this is really gonna be a hell of a series. And, look, I, I know people were talk, probably talking about this is the point heading into this series. Oh, the days off, the days off. Look, the bye and the days off thing is a joke. There's no excuse because, look, the Guardians won 7-0. The Yankees won. My Dodgers won. The Phillies are the only bye team that lost. The Mets are just a hot team right now, and the um, Phillies aren't. But yeah, back to the Dodgers. Uh, then we'll get to the bullpen here. Ryan Brazier, 1.2 innings. One hit, no one runs, no walks, one strikeout. Great outing from Ryan Brazier. Then we get to Alex Vesey, who goes one inning. No hits, no one runs, no walks, one strikeout. Then to Evan Phillips, who has 1.1 innings. No hits, no one runs, no walks, one strikeout. Then it gets a little bit shaky with uh, Michael Kopech. Um, he, he, he just looked a bit nervous out there tonight, I thought. It's just the command wasn't there like it usually is. Just... Struggled to find find the strike zone. He got that one strike out. Machado walked to, but hey, credit to Dave Roberts. He took Kopech out before it could have got worse. Put in Blake trying to get out of that inning. I know we give Dave Roberts a lot of credit, but I thought Dave Roberts managed the bullpen very well tonight. I got got give credit when credit's due. He managed the bullpen very very well. So Blake trying to goes one point two innings, thirty nine pitches. One hit, no one runs, two walks, three strikeouts to finish it off. So, a great game from game one for what is bound to be a great, great series. 
and T. Oscar really had the game-winning play hit in his first playoff win. Show he had the homer. Blake trying to record a freaking five-out save. And so Monday, oh, I'm going to freaking be freaking hot. Hopefully we can go up 2-0. But we can't just rely on the bullpen every single game. We really need to Jack Flaherty maybe go like six, six, about six innings. But I like our bullpen still. Like I tr I really trust the bullpen. And I really trust this offense. Especially by led with by, uh, led by Shohei. Uh, Dylan Cease, or no, whatever the Dodgers offense, Otani two for five, three RBIs, Bates over two, three walks. Uh, Freeman 2 for 5, Hernandez 1 for 4, 2 RBIs, Muncie 0 for 4. They move him down the lineup. He struck, he struck out like 2 or 3 times. Uh, Will Smith 0 for 2, 2 walks, 2 runs scored. Lux and Edmund reach 2 for 4, and Rojas 1 for 4. Dodgers go up 0 1. Padres drop to, uh, ugh, go down 0 1 in this series. Sorry, I can't talk. Uh, San Diego 7 hits for 5 runs. Dodgers had 10 for 7. Uh, Dylan Cease goes 3.1 innings, 6 hits, 5 earned runs, 2 walks, 5 strikeouts. Um, the Padres need way more from Dylan Cease in Game 1. Then they kind of beat themselves. They have to try and, if they want to beat us tomorrow, they're going to have to jump on Flaherty. But they jump, but all they've done is jump on starters lately. Um, but they've done good early jump on starters, but then they kind of just disappear in the middle innings. And that's not going to, that's not going to help. They just can't score against bullpens, it seems like. And I don't know why Dylan Cease threw a freaking pitch um, on the top of the zone to Shahani Atani. Um, Adrian Marone, point one innings pitch, one hit, one earned run, one walk, no strikeouts. Estrada, one point one innings pitch, two hits, one runs, one, no walks, one strikeout. And then we get to Jason Adam, one point one innings pitch, no hit, three runs, no walks, into one strikeout. Then to Brian Hoeing. 0.2 innings pitch, 1 hit, no runs, 1 walk, no strikeouts, and Tanner Scott. 1 inning, no hits, no runs, 1 walk, and 2 strikeouts. Now, the bullpen, or excuse me, for the um, batting, Luis Rios was 1 for 5, Todd Tease 2 for 4 and a walk, Pro uh, Profart 0 for 3, 2 walks, and an RBI, Machado 1 for 5, 2 RBIs, that's your homer, Merrill 0 for 2, 2 walks, Bogarts 2 for 4, 2 RBIs, Cronworth was 0 for 3 and a walk, Solano 0 for 4, some of those guys that have struggled lately, like Cronenworth, Solano, uh, Higashioka, one for two. He got pinch hit, uh, subbed out. Uh, Elias Diaz was 0 for one. And uh, David Peralta, 0 for one. Pinch, some pinch hitters there. Yeah, um, Dodgers take game one here, 7 to 5. Uh, the bullpen uh, was really good here. So, yeah, we'll see what happens. Um, Hopefully um, we can keep the momentum tomorrow. Go up 2-0. Because if they go up 2-0, all they got to do is go on the road and win one game. So, but this series is far from over. I'm not going to say it's over. But, I'm not going to say it's over. But I'm just looking forward to tomorrow. Hopefully Dodgers can take game two. So that's really what I say here. So, until next time, have a lot. Peace. Leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for Mets. Mets, Phillies, Dodgers, Padres, the uh, National League matchups. As we only got two games tomorrow. The AL will be back on um, Tuesday. So, yeah. Uh, peace.